Hello everyone and welcome back to Unreal Engine 5. So, thanks to the new UI and everything uh, being different, uh, a lot of people are wondering how to activate the Lumen system. So as you can see, the UI is definitely different and uh, everything is kind of misplaced. So if you're wondering how to activate Lumen, uh, there are two ways to do it. So the first way, so right now we are in the, uh, uh, the uh, Valley of the Ancient demo right here. So if you want to activate Lumen, all you have to do is just go to settings right here. And you simply go to uh, project settings and you scroll down right here to the left until you find the rendering uh, function. So just click that and then simply scroll down again until you find Lumen. There it is. Global illumination Lumen. So you can simply activate it or you can go back to uh, ray tracing, which is deprecated now, or uh, the screen space, which I don't know what that is. Uh, let's say standalone screen space, global illumination, low cost, but limited by screen space information. All right, so Lumen is the new stuff. We are all interested in the new stuff. You can also go to uh, right here, to uh, the Lumen Global Tracing right here, and you can go for Detailed Tracing, or of course you can go and uh, click on the Hardware Tray, uh, Hardware Ray Tracing, which uh, kind of like increases the level of detail in terms of shadows and light bounces. So this is way number one, and you will get these results right here from the demo, which are absolutely insane. Uh, the second way is to go to edit Project settings and it's basically the same thing you just scroll down until you find rendering or you can just go here and uh, write in lumen And it will take you straight to all the stuff that we've been talking about which are the global illumination the reflections and the lumen system that uses the hardware So this one uses the software you can also use the hardware if you have like a good gra graphic card uh, I'm currently running a uh, 3080 uh, RTX graphic card with 32 gigabytes of RAM so uh, it's, uh, it's a moderate like uh, PC spec but it runs it uh, pretty smoothly like uh, relatively smoothly and yeah this is that's how you do it uh, in case you guys uh, like this kind of type of content like make sure to subscribe and like the video uh, so I can know that people uh, like the content and that I should make more because I'm really I'm really uh, a big fan of Unreal Engine 5 especially uh, since 5 is out I've been excited about it uh, since last year so I'm keen to know uh, what else I can do with it especially when it comes to architectural visual visualization and yeah I'd love uh, to know what you guys think thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video bye bye